Hello, it's Gay Tube. So, uh, I thought, you know, I had something to do. So, I decided to make a tutorial kind of video because you guys do seem to like tutorials. So, I thought I would make a kind of like for dummy kind of thing because I there's books like editing for dummies or encoding from wow wow um so I thought I'd kind of make a video but this is gonna be YouTube for dummies now I'm not saying that everybody's dummies or you don't have to smash your keyboard like <laughs> that's yeah that's how you sound so the three things I'm going to be focused on in this video is annotations titles like creative tiles and stuff like that and thumbnails <clears throat> so uh, a question that most people had, well, actually not question, but um, the first one is annotations. Now, annotations are basically just clickable things that either have links or have like a title. Now, if you go to my vote for my outro video, let me just pause that. Um, oh yeah, skip this. Get rid of it. Hold on. So I had a little annotation right here that said skip the intro. And most people have a lot of questions for that because if you look at the timestamp we're at that. So if you click it, it'll instantly tell it'll instant not teleport, but it'll switch the timestamp and go to the video. Now a way to do that is uh, if you're on your thing right here. You're going to want to hit this little button right here that says annotations and just click it and it'll bring you it'll bring you to this and uh, like like right here it said I put an annotation now I can't really show you with this video so I'm going to uh, choose another video and I will be right back so I'm here on my funny gaming montage, the complete version. Now, uh, where I left off, I was about here. Go, a lot of weird stuff popping up. So the video ended right here, and I really didn't add anything new. So I'm going to add an annotation at the, be uh, the beginning of this video. Uh, we're gonna. Look at the timestamp, 149. I'm going to go to the play it minute, switch back, and then add an annotation you'll see right here. Now, there's three, ah, there's five different things. You have a title, spotlight, label, note, and speech bubble. Now, you can use any one of these. Uh, spotlight is mostly for links and text, so we're going to use a note. It is most uh, commonly known. And you can make it out of however big you want. I'm going to put it up here in this corner right here. Uh, you can add a little note. I'm just going to say skip past no skip past no part. Uh, so we have it there. We're going to change it to 28. Uh, and we'll keep it right here. And now for the time stop, uh, time stick part. You want to hit link, and uh, there'll be a little link. So that number, uh, you don't want to click this because that'll open it in a different window. Um, you're going to want to remember the number that was put in, <coughs> or the part. So we'll ha we have one forty-nine. I think it was. Nope, that was wrong. 40, 40, how do I, how do I work? One, wait, oh god, I don't know what that down. One, 49, yeah, okay. And we'll click change that to zero. And then you're gonna want to head to the same video. I have some links to things. So here we are on the page and you're gonna want to go to the up here where the link is to this video, the video that you want. Uh, hit Control C, 
and that will copy the thing and then you can close out of that. Go back to the video and hit and then paste the date into here. Uh, remember, don't click this open. And uh, if we just get past, um, the past here, we'll add a specific place. Shop my intro. <laughs> okay. So, we'll have it right here. And we'll give about, I'd say a nice five seconds would be good. That's about five seconds. Close enough. Um, so, there's a part right here. So what you want to do is you're going to want to, you can put out however long you want. Um, okay, it's already saved. Apply changes. And then you can head back to the video. And if we go right here. Oh, that's not the right one. Yeah. I don't know why I closed out of that. Um, so if we click this right here. Um, then you can see. If we skip past the intro, um, we can hit. Oh crap! I didn't skip that. You can hit that, and then it's instantly changed. Now, if we were to put on the uh, where it would open in another thing, save and apply changes. And then head back. And I keep closing up for some reason. Uh, hold on. And then we were to go past the intro. And it opens in another link and it doesn't just make it look clean. So you're just going to want to have it on the don't open in a link because that just makes it not look clean. Now the next one is thumbnails. Now thumbnails are the little pictures that you see before a video starts. Now most of mine are pretty, you know, legit. And the editor that I use to do this, some of them are just clips found in the video because I really don't have anything to put it. The editor that I use is Be Funky. There uh, is a link in the description, and if we go to a, a it's pretty easy to use. It's free um, to use as a solo. There is some parts of it that you cannot use because it is a, a private thing, but it's pretty simple to use. You can upload from your computer, and <laughs> there's a lot of things. So say I want to make a thumbnail for a tutorial video I would use. So I would use a basic one, like that's my template for my Minecraft series. So uh, once you save it, uh, you can't re-edit it, but um, there's text. You can add text, change the size, and stuff. So again, there's a link in the description. It's pretty easy to use. But uh, I'm going to teach you how to add your own thumbnail. So we're just going to go to a random video. So I'm here on my uh, deep sleep video. And uh, this is based, the base of it. Uh, you can put your description tags, uh, add it to a thing, save it to anything you have. But uh, we're going to go for these. Now these are your thumbnails. Now, uh, these, these three are set as bases. They choose random timelines throughout the video, and that would be set as a th thumbnail. But if I were to, say, go to a different video... So I'm here on my How to Farm Exotic Engrams in Destiny. Uh, this video does not have a... Uh, this has the three base. And you can add thing. I don't even know what that was. Let's just save changes. Um, but this video uh, got very popular. Um, it had a lot of views and a lot of likes, which I really like because it kind of started out my channel. But we're not here for that. We are here for this. Now this is the custom thumbnail button. 
Uh, this was my original thumbnail that I had, but I chose this one because it was more base. And you can hit custom thumbnail and add any picture you want. This is basically my setup for that. And I have this, which you can add any thumbnail, and these are PNGs. And PNGs do not apply for thumbnails. Uh, if you don't know what a PNG is, it's basically where it's a picture, but it has no background. And it just changes the background to black uh, because, you know, for safe editing. But basically, that's how you add your own custom thumbnail. Again, you can use Be Funky, links in the description. Uh, basically, that's it. And I'm going to switch my old thumbnail. And that's how you use thumbnails. Now, the last and final tutorial thing is titles. Now, most of my titles are kind of clever. I wouldn't say that they're mostly just basically a quick description. Uh, Destiny Lord, Osiris, and Year One Highlight, Monday, Monday, all this crap. And uh, some of my videos do have a nice kind of clever thing if I can find one. Uh, bagels and stuff. Now, you can just add, you know, what you're doing. Uh, what happened and stuff, like in my Slender the Arrival, I had, wait, what, because I kept lagging and stuff, so I just added, like, a what, what, huh? Um, and that's the thumbnail, but you basically just want this to be a quick description of what you're going to do. Um, if I can, it's basically PC Sunday, Slender the Arrival, the game, and if you want, you can add a, a like, a little description of it, uh, sometimes I did have a number, episode 3, episode 1, episode 2, just a quick little thing to describe what's happening, uh, the 8 pages question mark, because it's not blah, blah, blah. So, uh, that's basically all, uh, just a quick description of what you want, and, uh, yeah. So, if you enjoyed the video and you want to see more kind of computer tutorial kind of things, uh, let me know in the comment below. And uh, hit that like button because it helps me out a lot. And until next, oh, subscribe button. I always forget that. Uh, subscribe right here if you are not yet subscribed. Uh, I post daily. And until next time, I'm Gaming's signing out. Peace.